Chip Thrills. Yo, what up? It's your boy Nate, aka Tabasco Sweet, and you're watching Cheap Thrills. You already know what it is. Today I'm gonna show you how to make your own Gucci flip flops without having to drop some serious coin. The Gucci flip flop is a staple of any decent shoe collection. These iconic slides started first gaining popularity in 2015 when they made cameos on the feet of some of my favorite real ones like Kanye West, Soldier Boy, and DJ Khaled. While there are hella lightweight slide options out there on the market, the swagger of the Gucci flip-flop remains unrivaled. Now how about that slapper by Future Hendrix? I just f*** your b and some Gucci flip-flops. But on the real, some guy really did steal my girl once and he was wearing Gucci flip-flops. Uncool, man. But that's about the time I decided I really needed some of those bad boys in my collection. What sets this slide apart from other sandals on the market is the highly recognizable green-red-green three-stripe marking on the strap. Whether you go with the black or the white base color, these legendary slides compare with literally anything. It says like, I'm chilling, I'm relaxing, but I'm hard as f so don't beef with me. Now, Gucci flip-flops run for about $190. Personally, I have not f***ed up any commas yet, so I gotta shave off that extra zero. You feel me? Today, I'm gonna show you how to bless your feet with some totally convincing fuchis for $19 or less. So here's what you're gonna need. Some black shower sandals, some red and green electrical tape, black puffy paint, and a pair of scissors. Pretty simple. You're gonna start off with your basic black shower sandal. And you're gonna use your tape to get the three stripe marking on the strap. I found it easier to use the red tape to start with the center marking. Then you're gonna use your green tape and work it out from there. So I'm gonna start by going across the length of the sandal with my red center stripe. You wanna make sure it's smooth and there's no creases. Like I always say, no crease, mad peace. Don't worry if there's a little extra hanging off. We can always trim the fat with the scissors. Now, I'm gonna add some green tape to the bottom and top of the red stripe. So now I'm gonna carefully lay out this green tape on the top of the red. And you wanna make sure that you leave a little bit of black on the top and the bottom. In the world of premium footwear, you gotta be able to spot your reels from your fakes. Now, how can you tell a real one, Nate, you might ask? If there's gaps in between the red and the green stripe, that sandal's definitely fake. That's a dead giveaway. Now we're gonna add our second green stripe. Now be careful because placement is absolutely crucial. Cut off that extra tape. Now we're gonna move on to our second sandal. We're gonna bring it all the way across the length of the strap. Now we're gonna add our third green stripe on the bottom. Once we've got our stripes in optimal condition, then we can move on to adding the logo. Now we're not done with the tape yet. We're gonna take a little bit and mask off the sides where you're gonna put your Gucci logo. Here's where it gets really serious. The logo can make or break your Fuchis. You wanna have a nice steady hand and patience is key. Usually when these are drying, I like to open up FL Studio and work on some beats. All right, it's been about 20 minutes. So there you have it. Green, red, green stripe, and the 3D logo. For maximum authenticity, always photograph them far away so they look more real. That's why I always carry my Extendo. Very clean. Swagger boost. Wear your Gucci flip-flops with some clean white socks. The ladies love a pair of clean white socks. That's what my mom's told me. As you can see right now, I'm rocking my fins. But now I'm ready for a more laid back and relaxed look. So what do y'all think? Who wore it better? Soldier Boy or your boy? Versus. Maximize your swag by pairing these flip flops with a gold chain. Maybe you can even go shirtless, but I don't know if I can do that yet. I'm not inked up like Soldier Boy is. Even Soldier Boy knows that you should take your picks from a good distance. I mean, I can't even tell if his are real or fake. Vote in the comments, my dude. If you f with the vision, please try this at home. And make sure to hashtag Cheap Thrills Fan. In the next video, I'll choose my favorite one. Make sure to peep my SC, too. I'm always making beats. If you want one from me, hit me up. Serious inquiries only. Ladies, 1-800-HMU, baby. Wasn't that nice? Subscribe to Super Deluxe for more.